In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create your very own free Mac USB memory card for your PlayStation 2 by yourself. There are some pre requirements which you need before starting this video. So, you need one USB drive, one DVD drive, one DVD, and one PlayStation 2 memory card. So, now let's head straight to the video. So, first, we need to identify whether our PS2 is compatible with DVD loader. So, to do that, just run your PlayStation 2 without a disk. And once you're on this browser system configuration screen, press triangle on your controller to open this version information. Over here, just note down your console version version and DVD player version then you need to move back to your computer then go to the DVD boot compatibility list website from the description below and you will be on this free DVD boot compatibility list from here search the model of your console and also look for the disk version to see whether your device is compatible or not almost all the slims version are compatible with this free DVD boot for me the console ID is SCPH9004 as you saw in the start of the video and on here all the disk drive and version is supported please look for for your device as well as disk version whether it's supported or not and then proceed with the next steps then next proceed to this github website to download free dvd boot for your specified version console version so as you can see there are a lot of console versions and if your dvd drive is for a specific version you can select the one from here but for the slim versions there is just one single iso which works for everything as you can see pre-built iso all ps2 slims english language iso we will just click on it and then click on this three dots on right top and click on download and as you can see our iso file is downloaded next come to this website called imageburn.com from description below and click on this mirror 7 provided by image burn and once you get this warning just click on it and click on download unverified file then the very last come to this ps2 home website to download the final file which is free mcb file come down and download the zip file once all the files are downloaded just put them in the same folder and it will be easier for you to navigate around so next we are going to install this image burn software to burn this iso file on our disk to so do that just double click on this setup image burn then click on yes Click on next, click on accept, then next, 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 next. And once the software is done installing, just click on finish and delete this imageburn.exe setup file to avoid clutter. Then we have to load up this image burn app. So once this software is open, just click on this write image file to disk. Then from here on this source, click on this file icon. And now we go to our downloads. And then we're gonna select this ISO file. And once you do that, click on this write speed and make it to 2x. Then next, just put your DVD into your DVD drive. So once you put your DVD in your DVD drive, it will be written ready on this left bottom corner. Just click on this write option and wait for it to write the ISO file on your DVD. And once your DVD will be done writing the ISO file on disk, you will get this pop-up called operation successfully completed then just click on ok and close the image burn software so now you can also delete this iso file next we are gonna put this fmcg file on our usb drive we will just extract it right click on it click on extract all then click on extract and then it will get extracted i'll just close this pop-up and we have to put this entire folder into our usb drive you can delete this zip file as we have already unzipped it then we have to insert a usb drive into our computer and once we do that just go to your this pc so once you put your usb drive into your computer just right click on it go to format and then select fat32 from file system as that is the only format supported in playstation 2 and after that just click on start and click on ok and your drive will get formatted into FAT32 now we'll go back to our FMCV file and we'll just rename this folder to something easy and next we have to just cut or copy this file onto our USB drive and once it's done all this setup on our computer part is done and now we'll take our disk and USB drive to PlayStation 2 so once you prepare your disk, your USB drive and your memory card of PS2 whether it be 8 MB or 64 MB just put everything on your PlayStation 2 and just click on power button An operation will boot directly into free DVD loader and once you're on the screen just press circle on your controller to go to file browser then use the d-pad button to go to this mask 
click on circle on your controller then use your d-pad to go down again and then again click on circle on your controller then use your d-pad to go down and then on this fmcb installer.elf click on circle again to select it then I'll click on x now to continue and install and once you click on ok it will start installing on your memory card just wait for it to get installed completely once the installation is complete just press x on your controller and now you can exit using the d-pad and press x to exit then again use the d-pad and go on ok and press x 